is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Welcome back, folks. We got markets continuing to plow higher. This is the 10 a.m. update coming to you live from TFNN, and we got the S&Ps right now up 89 points. 1.7 will make it 90. 1.72% the positive, trading at 53.56. We're now above where we were intraday yesterday, which is remarkable considering the fact that we traded down 100 points by 6 p.m. Eastern time, and we get it all back by 10 a.m. Eastern time. Quite a volatile market. NASDAQ 100, you're up by 2%. I was just doing the numbers during my show. You're approaching almost 7% from the lows we had intraday on Monday, pre-market to be exact. 7% in the NASDAQ 100. You're up by 1,200 points in a 17,000-point index. And you have the S&Ps right now up more than 200 points, approaching 240 points, almost 5%. The S&Ps are up off the lows we had Monday. Dow up 465 right now. That's 1.2% in the positive at 39,600. And how about the Russell? Up by 1.6%. We jump around to commodities. Crude up a buck 33, trading at 74.55. We can jump over to gold up by nine dollars at twenty four forty so far this morning. And notes and bonds, we got a little bit of lower price and higher yield coming at you. We got the ten years talking about this on the program too. Pretty remarkable where we sit. We're sitting at three point nine four, which is twenty five basis points higher than where we were just two days ago. Nonetheless, we're still under ten. Uh, on the 10-year, under 4%. We're sitting at 3.94. We were as low as about 3.68%, the yield on the 10-year, when we were spiking on Monday. Pretty interesting, the moves going on in that market. Dollar index, 103.20. We're up about 23 ticks. We jump around to some of the companies with their earnings. Disney out with their numbers, down 2.5% so far this morning. Rivian. Uh, with their numbers down by 3.5% so far. Airbnb getting punished, down by 15% now, down $19.70. $19, we'll call it down $20, basically, for Airbnb. Rivian, down by 4%, catching a little bit of a pop, as I mentioned there. What else we got? We do CVS, down by 1% at 57.72, and we'll finish up with Instacart. Instacart, they give it all back. As I said, be careful on that one. And, uh, yeah, they're having a great conversation in the den. Listen, I, I use it for some of those big-ticket items, but what I will say is I was just playing with it on my phone, man. Even if you're not paying delivery fees, you're paying service fees, you're paying a tip, and usually you are paying higher prices per product at some stores, most of them around me. Folks, thanks so much. Stay tuned. Back